Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. This is the Inept General, and welcome to part 29 of my Von Karstein playthrough. And as in the previous part, we are starting off by being ambushed by a large amount of dwarves. Uh, they shouldn't be too much of a challenge, but those may be Thaman's last words. So, we've got a good unit here. We have to hit hard and fast. And let's see where reinforcements are coming from. I think that will be key in this battle as well. We also might get to see Krell for the first time in this campaign. That would be very exciting. So this first little army isn't much of an issue. It's Ungrim's army I'm worried about. Now, a lot of this depends on where Ungrim, with the largest army, actually appears. Okay, what are we looking at? One ahead of us. And one behind us. Okay, and the little army will be somewhere over here. So, how are we going to do this? Okay. I think we really have to... Pop Let's hope this isn't Ungrim. If this is Ungrim, we have a problem. If it's not, I think we could be actually pretty okay. Can he hide in woods? He can't, can he? He's too big. No, he can't hide in woods. Can they hide in woods? Uh, 20 is okay. They can't hide in woods. Okay. All right, I've got a couple of lights. Sorry, I'm thinking a stage ahead already, guys. So let's deal with this first of all. Let's take this slow, deal with this problem, and then we'll deal with the next one. So let's get the grave guard up. Make it wide. Uh, now, this is on Grooms. We might have slayers back here. That'll be a problem. Have you back there? You three back here. Cavalry. This side. This side. I think everything else. Just kind of pull back over here. You guys. Join them there. Join them there. Alright, let's kick this off. This whole group of troops to do is to move up. Sorry about my notification going off there, guys. Wait, where's the line? There it is. Just like that. And just like that. All right, let's do this. Let's get you moving up. Got our flyers moving up. Didn't like that bombing run at all. That made me very unhappy, in fact. Oh, before we got shot, please attack them.
Okay, what's behind us? Okay, they ran. Paradise, get in here against them. It's not fighting, should be fighting. We have time. That's something the that Darwi does afford us. Let's get you back. Okay, that looks like them chased off. Get everything that was hurt to line up. Actually, all of you guys need to really pay it. Pretty much get over here. as well. Chase him down, would you? Make sure he doesn't come back. Yes, Heinrich. Double power invocation, please. And we'll march everything against this little pod in the front once everyone's had a chance to heal up nicely. What are we looking at? Just the general, some miners, some thunderers, and those things. We'll need the flyers for cover. Seven. Pull up here, flyers. I see my cavalry, the chariot, you guys, puppy. This cav. Two heroes start making towards him. Everybody else line up on the hill. Let's get the cavalry units moving first. Into them. You lads, into them. Okay, I'll make that work, everybody. Now, as for the rest of everybody else, how should we do this? Let's have everyone else make a line up here. Spears back here. Taking some hits. about the range on these things. Is there any artillery out for this army yet? None that we can see. The 
they're caught. Terror guys hasn't caught them yet. Actually, don't attack him. He has actual magic damage. That could be a problem for us. Oh, Terror guys, back off. to get over here. What have I left over here? Can you guys kill this general, please? A bit quicker. Alright, you try and hide in these woods. That would be great. Hidden? Can you hide in these woods? Try hiding in these woods. Actually, these ones might be better. Is this one dead? guys stop fucking about with them come back here have you guys killed him yet or is he just running away how much life does he have 41 that's got to be him dead yeah all right get back So these guys can actually hide. Are you guys hidden? Yes. Okay, perfect. Now we've got them coming off at this real weird angle over here. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Should have kept chasing them off. Got distracted. cast a single invocation on them. Oh, we might have them trapped now at least. Give them a big juicy target. Hidden. Perfect. Okay, we've got two of our cavalry units hidden. Now these look like the only two gyros on the field. This might work out perfectly actually. We've got a shed ton of thunderers over here. So we can't charge out just yet. We can send our flyers up to that hill over there, though. Once they finish that gyro. Now, how else do we want to do this? Spears. Doesn't really matter what the spears do, but just put them on here on the flanks for funsies. More we'll and get straight in the middle over here. boys get a little bit closer. You boys too. You come out here. You come out here. Surely they can't see them. No. What are they tracking? The flyers. Yeah. Alright, flyers. Give them something to see. 
Don't make them look for us. And we're going to have to try and hold tight in a nice little death ball up here. They can see us all. That's fine. Just pull it back a bit. Uh oh. You guys get down as quickly as you can. I'll let the terror guys go and finish stuff on the hill. Okay, here they come. Maybe throw in a raise dead. Just before they start charging. Just as their missiles come into range as well, so actually shoot my good troops. So maybe... Oh, now. Okay, you're going in there, you're coming straight in here Blood Knights, you're going straight into them, you are threading the needle there, Let's see how that all goes. How's the terror guys doing? Ah, he's doing alright. You going against his bolt throws? Oh, beautiful charge from our calves straight into two units of thunderers. You must have some fun magic for us, Vampires. Let's do this. Where should we do it? On these guys. Blood Knight straight into the back of these, please. Let's get Kemler over here as well. Oh no, don't get charging into the Slayers. Charge into something more fun like over here. All these Thunderers. Oh, I think we might have this. Where's Ungram himself? That's what we have to watch out for. Hold on. He's got to be on its battlefield, right? He just probably doesn't have an icon. There he is. Where's Krell? How close does he have to be? Here. Alright, that's happening. This is happening. Oh. 
Get him, Krell. Let's get in on this. Alright, it did about equal damage to each other there. Get out of there, cavalry. Chase some of this nonsense down. They're breaking all over the shop. Cryptoras. What are those? More slayers. Cryptoras charge over here. Spears turn round. Grave guard. That should be enough. Uh, white. Go over here, help out Krell. And you, Vamp. Just absorb some damage. Slayers. Slayers. Chase down some of these guys. But do it by coming this way. Alright, back to full speed. Crowd on. It's crowd drop already. Oh no, here it is. Here's why these guys are still crumbling. That makes little to zero sense as we're winning. Who's running? Oh, Krell. Gave in. Didn't last very long, did you, Krell? What's uh, this one? got to be the end of Ungram there. We did that fairly convincingly. I'm pretty happy with that result, lads. There he is. Ungram, wounded. Cavs doing a nice job cleaning up. You guys getting on this action as well. There we go. Um, yeah, let's kill as much as we can. Keep chasing them down, lads. Can you catch these guys at all? Probably not, right? Have them kill these miners. Not enough blood knights left. Speed up his cleanup operation. Go on, get him, get him. This is a lot. What are these? Oh, quarrelers. Yeah, get rid of those. 40 quarrelers. How long does it take a terror guy to get rid of three grudge throwers who are fleeing?
Oh, that's about it. Is that that? One, 42, 20, 101, 93, 70, 60, 6, 37, 63, 125. Yeah, the cat. Oh, oh Blood Knights, 321. That is superb. That is a great performance. Three hundred twenty-one is huge. That's almost one of their armies entirely, or the losses one of their armies took. Oh yeah, and one of their armies. Blood Knight is putting some great work. I wasn't even cycle charging them too much. No idea how many Krell got, if any. But he did, he did some probably good damage to Ungrim. But couldn't take out Ungrim one-on-one -on -one at the time he had. Make that a point of note. Our Hex Wraiths did crumble, though. Which isn't ideal. Okay, now we've got a lot of killing to do. Hey, what else? My allies? Nah, that's alright. You can fight Bretonian by yourselves. Not too interested in that just now. I've got too much to deal with. Got to fight the Empire. Got to get the Red Duke on that case. Wonder if we can make peace with Norska. We might be able to now. Ooh, Obsidian Blade. Nice. Likes dwarves. How'd you get that impression? She spent ages killing them. She just killed 62 of them. Cloak and Mist. Raise or sack three different servants belonging to the Empire. Greyherd, swear. Oh, wow, this is actual beast men. That means Kazarag's probably popped up somewhere. How about you, Norse? Can we make peace? You come before me, pleading a Let's do this. This allows me to march south into the Empire. Who am I still at war with, then? Still war with these the scaling. There we go, peace treaty. Okay, now just dwarves in the Empire. I need to go to War of Britannia at some point, but that's not... Okay, that helps us out immeasurably. Because that means the old lad needs to fear, by taking Norden, is the Empire. And I don't think there's an Empire stack anywhere around here. Now we have Isabella here, ready to take this beast man herd on. Manfred's doing okay over here. Probably might need some walls. Can't build those yet because we're still building. So Manfred's a little bit stuck. But now we've broken the back of the dwarves. Still no peace treaty, wow. Alright, dwarves. This will be a fight that lasts... An eternity. What did we lose? We lost a unit of the um, Wraith Knights. Could replace them with Hex Wraiths. They're armor piercing. But cavalry is always helpful against the dwarves. Where should we start with our murder spree? That's something we should ask ourselves. No should we start with these two and then take this one? Why can't you move very far? They must have done something to us. Let's go this way. Oh, 
I managed to limit my movement, which I'm not at all happy about. But I'm actually okay. We're still in our turf. We're going to recruit. We're going to get something extra. Or actually, we could just take the Banshee on. Where is our Banshee gone? Oh, here she is. So let's have you join the army. Stop, stop us getting into any more trouble. And we do also have a... Uh, yes, build that. Why not? For funsies. Alright, Isabella. What should we do with you? I think everyone else just needs to wait and chill out. We have a lot of money. That's... Just... Raise dead. You can't really raise anyone, though. That's the problem over here. Is there anywhere where there's been a great battle we can maybe raise some people? I mean, we're not currently at war with um, Bretonia, so we could do this cheekily. There we go. Some expensive troops on the expensive. All right, let's get you this. Let's get you this. Let's get you those. Let's get you one of these. Let's get you one of these. Let's get you one of these for sure. Uh, what else do we want? Let's grab these two cavalry units for fun. And some Zombonis. Then get you back into our own turf. That should be enough to put down most rebellions. And then we'll recruit probably both of those into his army... Uh, next turn. Actually, no, one of them will go into Gorse. He'll take the dogs, though. And actually, we don't want him isolated in case there is a rebellion this turn. So let's get him back into the actual castle, or at least close enough to it. Isabella's fine. Manfred's fine. Let's see you do something. Can't block that army, can't afford it. Uh, we'll just have you over here. There's an, there's an Empire agent up here we have to deal with. Alright. Soulbinder. Can race hex wraiths. Zombos don't really care. Scouts and spearmen. Zombos don't really care. Whites, Blood Knights, Black Coach. I think that's good for this. Yeah. Make our Blood Knights even dead. Yeah, let's end the turn there. Osland. Let's go for growth in Osland, shall we? Isabella, still going up, despite the fact we haven't had you do anything in a few turns. Good for you. Make you a bit hardier. Actually, not that one. Let's go back. Make you a bit hardier. Heinrich. Yes, please. Yes, please. Mind Razor, that'll do us. You can never have enough winds of magic. Senpai's got troops, they're just annoying the Norse. Doesn't bother me in the slightest. It means we're free to expand our Empire of the Dead in the North, which is actually pretty brilliant. Dwarves are running. They can't all run. 
Well, maybe they can, actually. Some pretty good distance the dwarves are getting on their stunty little legs. Now, we had intended on sending Kemlo round to Bretonia. We haven't had enough turns for Gorse to turn back up yet. Because I think over the last two episodes, we've had about two turns, so that's not exactly progress. Ah, we'll safeguard refuse this creature. Don't need any more of that chaos corruption coming our way. How many more turns till Gorst is back? One turn. Okay. What are we looking at army-wise here? Alright, Red Duke. Let's get you moving. Castle Leonez. Mm, that's a lot of our money. I might save that. Kill this little empire captain. That'd be great. Critical for success. Wonderful. Here we go. Alright, we're not at War of the North, so I don't actually have much else to fear. So we can go on a bit of a city building spree. You do probably need us to lay this guy out. Leave Manfred to colonize the rest of the north. Actually, no. We're going to kind of hold our territory for now. Isabella. Should we send you to get Zoys Link? No. Isabella's going to be our safety in case they get any ideas. coming into our hinterland. So we're going to send Isabella back south as quickly as we can. Vlad can hold this rabble off up here. What's Barracks of ours, defenses? Almost non-existent. Akendorf. This is what you're going to do for a little bit. You're just going to farm these dwarves. They never got this. These this. If they'd gotten this stack involved in all these fights we've been having down here, we might be having a very different discussion. What to do now? Lads resting. You've moved, you've moved, you've moved. You're helping with building costs. Actually, no, let's go building crazy. That's what we're going to do. Castle von Rauken. What should we build here? All this. Upgrade. left can't build anything new there yet and then we can build something new
Anything that can make us money there. Vampiric corruption. Public order. Growth. It's not a growth thing already. Oh, that's just public order and money. Uh, Alright, just for now. Because we've got money to spend. Well, it can be a recruiting one, so we'll just build that. Where else can we build? Avaland. Yes, please. Oblast. Get something up here. Can't really build anything yet. Eastern border princes. This will not be a recruitment place, so I uh, will maybe build one of those next turn. And that's about it. All right, let's end the turn. Make sure they're not on growth ones. That's a tax rate. Tax rate. Tax rate. Still on growth, but actually need to grow. Need to grow. All right. There you go. Okay, so missile resistance. See if we can't get a couple more turns in before the end of the episode. So with the Norskans actually keeping the Empire busy, I think we can actually have a good showdown against them eventually. We plow through a lot of turns in the next couple of episodes. Allow them to build up their strength. I'm most scared of the Dwarves at the moment, if I'm honest. This kind of incessant... Stacks and stacks and stacks of dwarves constantly pouring out of their armies. It's full of slayers and what have you. Oh, don't get smart with me, Tilia. Where do you think you're going? Forest of Arden. And Helm and Gorst is back. Leadership plus six, all forces. Okay, we've got a few rebelling armies, it seems. First one to deal with is this. They might actually have a better army than me. Let's have a look. Yes, they do in fact have a better army than me. Alright. So, Scarecrow Banner is what? Minus four leadership. These guys cause, like... Do you guys cause terror or fear? Yeah, terror. All right, we'll give it to them. Plus five leadership. People we just need to stick in there. How about you guys? Let's get you the dogs. And we can recruit some actual soldiers here. Excellent. That's a proper front line. That's a good back. Got some crypt horrors. Get rid of these zombos. Also have some can race. I don't necessarily want too many can race. It's a bit of a weird army. Wouldn't mind the flyer. Like a terror geist or something. Vargulf. But it looks like that's not an option for us at the moment here. So instead, what we should probably do is recruit. 
Let's just recruit another Grave Guard. Have a wider front line. Take it from there. Let's go back to our moneymaker in the south. Hey, buddy. Let's take the vaults. Kill them, my children. Commit, minions, commit. Nicely done, my bunny. It's an extra 5,000. So let's get settlements. Where do we need to build something more? Not Sylvania. You're getting upgraded as it is. Troll Country could do with an upgrade. Really looking for a place I can build something that make money. Like here. No, you don't have an extra necromancer, do you? You already are a necromancer. 350, 350, 500, 500. Let's build one of those. Last I can hold out for a while. These guys aren't at war with me. Who are they at war with? Who are they trying to get to? Make your demands. They're actually trying to get to Norska. Or the be there must be a Beastman army around here somewhere. One hopes, because I think, yeah, they're trying to come after me. Won't be happy about it. Isabella, you're still moving. You kind of have an idea of where you're going, right? Well, maybe not. So we want you as a well. The lad's back to full force. But needs to guard this whole area. Doc will make us some nice money. Manfred's having a great time. Let's end the turn. Do power drain. Okay, let's go out. Let's have maybe one more turn, then we'll end the episode, guys. What are these dwarves all going to do? Norskins look like they're attacking at Salzenmund. And they've got another stack coming up. Go on, dwarves. Let's, do, let's, go, let's go through this whole rigmarole again, then, shall we? Ah, uh, sure. Are they trying to attack Britannia, or are they just taking a really weird route through our lands, taking tons of attrition? Oh, nice! I think that weakened them a great deal. Have a look at what happened. What was the result of that fight? Oh, nice. The Tillians won. Just, but they won. I'll take that any day of the week. Now we've just got a little rebellion over there to deal with. And somewhere else, I think. Hold on. Where else do we have enemy armies showing up? Yeah, that's the rebellion. I think the other raiding we keep getting a warning about is this raiding they're doing over here. The Cheeky Empire. What are you doing it with? Oh, bloody Not hell. Possible. Grim. What are you 
do have a necromancer. Oh, no, we already have one in this province, I think, so we're all right. So we'll do this. Yeah, build that. That's a solid defense, but I think we can probably take it. Are we healed up? Yeah, let's go exploring, shall we? Let's try and get just beyond their reach. That should probably do it for us. I don't think that army should be able to reach them in time. What we're going to do here... Is bring back. Where has he gone? What? Where is he? Oh, ghost. Let's have this vampires join his ranks. assassin moving and i think we will end this episode there guys so next episode we kind of just had to we had a couple of battles early on there but next episode we are going to be solidifying the empire of the dead i kind of want the empire to build up its own strength so we actually have a bit of a classic uh, cl clash against them um we will raise ghost and we will uh I'm just wondering whether it's worth sticking Ghost in the north just to hold it down and sending Vlad all the way down here to start dealing with these dwarves. Or whether I can just leave this to Heinrich and to Kemmler. I mean to Heinrich and to uh, Ghost. I mean they're great at making numbers but that's not necessarily the best thing you want against the Dawi. Neither of them are a baller, brawler boss. Um, we'll think on that. We'll decide when what to do about that next turn. Uh, but for now, guys, as always, thank you all for watching. Special thanks to my patrons, Reese, Colin, Thomas, Mateus, Samuel, Matthews, David, Sign of the Empire, Emperor, and Niblets. All right, guys, as always, hope to catch you on the next one.